Hi guys, welcome back to another Game Boys Real Awesome video, guys. And today is another car boot pickup video. So, yeah, I hit up a car boot today on a Wednesday. It's lovely weather today. Uh, quite windy, but it's warm as well ish. Um, so, yeah, it's been really bad weather recently, isn't it? I've not been to any car boots for a little bit. So, this is my first one for a week or so. Uh, maybe two weeks or so, I don't know, a while ago. Last one you would have seen when I got that. that guitar and that and all the bass guitar and stuff that's when I went to a car boot um so yeah um nice to hit one up again as, as it's been nice weather today um the weather's been pretty good it's been today anyway but the past few days has been really bad so hopefully it, it stays like this for a bit but we never know it's so under unpredictable um so yeah so today I've got some bits I got some Pokemon bits um, I found some Pokemon cards mixed in with some fakes, I think. Well, yeah, they are. Don't, don't, can't say I think when I literally know they are fake. They're really bad. But there's also some nice ones in there as well. So, first off, um, I'll show you some ones. I got them from a lady. You know, I buy loads of stuff from you. See, we get controls and that. There was just in a box all over everywhere. And I just go and every, every, pick them out of every box I can find. Um, but the first stuff I found are the Builder Bear ones, which are cool. So I've got the Pikachu one, but I haven't got Eevee. So Eevee's going to be kept. Um, and there's also some vintage ones in here as well, uh, which is nice. So there's also like, uh, this is a first edition. Um, first edition. And then we've got these ones. So that's cool. There's also some japanese ones on there as well. Um, must be more of a modern ones because... Is it modern ones? I don't know. I don't know what year this one is. I don't even know that Pikachu, that Pikachu, that Pokemon. Never seen it in my life. So, yep. Yeah. Uh, another classic. Um, what else? We have another set here as well, which has some nice uh, Japanese ones as well. Got Japanese ones there. And a few nice Team Rocket. Team Rocket. I used to like collecting Team Rocket set. Uh, I used to get them a lot. Back in the day, I used to get them from um, Safeway. If I remember Safeway, um, back in the day when probably about early 2000s, maybe late 2002, maybe 2001. Pokemon was kind of it was still alright, but they were trying to, you know, uh, what year did these ones come out? Yeah, 2000. So probably about 2002, one. Um, they were like still taking cards. They were like cards are going down cheaper. Pokemon cards are cheaper, um, and then in, in there they used to sell um, Team Rocket pack uh, for 50p a pack. So every time I used to go in there, my mum she'll buy me a couple of packs, um, which was awesome. I used to love it uh, for for 50p each. And uh, yeah, I used to be I used to love it. I used to love getting them. I used to get some right good cards in there as well. Um, still got some of the cards from what I would have, would have pulled out about set years ago. Um, so that's cool. So there's also a lot of stack of us here as well. But as you can see, a lot of them are, camp are actually fake in there. Um, which I, I would go through, but I'll be here for ages. Also, I found, um, uh, I found these. These are pretty cool. I remember these when I was younger. Um, well, basically, I've got a story about these cards. Let me show you. Um, these ones here. These are the movie cards. They're mixed in. They're not in the best nick. Um, as you can see. Movie cards. They're not in the best nick. But, um, yeah. I'm happy to have some of these again. Because I used to have these. The story is, um, when I was a kid, um, someone actually robbed my Pokemon cards from me. Um, which I was very upset about. Someone stole them out of my bag at school. And um, so I was, I was like upset for it. I was really, really upset about it. Um, I noticed that there were well, really weird story is. I like, I wonder where my Pokemon cards were. They disappeared, and um, and then I went in my school bag, the next like whenever, and um, they suddenly just reappeared in my bag. I was very, very like confused. So I ran, I went into the boys' toilets of all places to go um and poured all my pokemon cards on the floor of all places to do that but you know um and i, I went through it all and i realized someone is actually 
pinched, took my cards from me and took them home or something and um, picked through. Picked through and took all my good cards and left with me left me with all the shit. So I was left with all my crap cards and they took all my hollows, rares, any card that they needed and s sneakily put it back in my bag so I wouldn't realise. You know, that was that was weird. But I was very upset because all my favourite cards were taken. And um, so I told my dad and that, um, my mum and that, and my dad, he didn't know. I don't think, I don't know. I don't really know the story. He just watched this. He just watched this, um, these videos. Um, but he found Pokemon cards, what he thought were Pokemon cards. And he brought me a, a, literally a stack full. So many, it was mad. Um, I don't know how many packs. There were probably about 30 packs, 20 packs. And there were the movie cards. So I was very grateful of them, but there weren't the cards that I actually were collecting. Uh, there were the, you know, I was after these ones, but I wasn't after, um, you know, these. I didn't even know they existed at the time. So, yeah, to actually, you know, get these instead, they were pretty cool. I don't know what I did with my original ones, but these are the cards I would have got. So he replaced me, got me these because he, he thought they were, well, I don't know. He thought they were probably Pokemon cards, which they are Pokemon cards, but not the cards that uh, were the ones that I was after. But it was very nice of him to do that. And I still remember it to this day, him coming over and giving me them. Um, still made my uh, made my day having them as well. So, yeah, what a story, because I still remember it like it was yesterday. Or well, not yesterday, but still remember it quite well. Um, yeah, it was very, very upsetting when I was about an hour would have been. When was it been? Nine, ten, something like that. And uh, yeah, someone stole my cards, which didn't steal all of them. They left me with all the crap, which is probably even worse because my favourites. And the thing is, though, I had a Pokemon card in there, which got washed in the wash machine. And I, and I say I taped it all up to kind of keep it all together and they even stole that as well. So that's like, like they could have even left me with that, but they didn't. They, they even took that. And I was like, oh, my God, literally, how desperate were they to take my cards? I kind of have an idea who, who it could have been who robbed them, but, you know, it's one of those things. It's like, uh, how many years ago now has it been? Over 20 years ago. Well, over 20 years, about 23 years ago now. Um, so we're going to go through what else I've got with that deal. Um, so I've got this controller here, which is a knockoff. Um, it's not really... It's not a legit one, but I thought I've got quite a few spare crystal crystal control crystal Xboxes that I need to move on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bundle that in with it if it works, and it will make it look a bit nicer. And actually having a, a clear controller, so I got that with the deal. This is unofficial, but I thought it looked really nice. I don't know if it will work. Probably not. It might need that dongle, man. It which allows it to link up, but I don't care. I thought it looked cool. So I've got a uh, nice uh, controller here. I don't know if you can actually swap out the swap out this case and put it on a legit one. I don't know, but I thought it was very nice. So yeah, I grabbed it. As well, in that bundle, I've got a Wii controller, a Wii, a Wii controller, and adapt and a way adapter for the 360. And you get that with it as well. I don't know if I got this as well with it. I got that as well from it. I think I paid 12 quid for all that. I think the iPod might not have been with it. I don't know. You have to see the footage. Um, so I paid 12 quid for all that with the Pokemon cards, which isn't too bad. And then I also found these at her stall. Um, I'm not sure what they're called. I don't know if they're the Wii controller, no switch adapter controller things, but they were they were a quid each. So yeah, these little adapters. No, this wasn't with it. This wasn't with the bundle. This is with this. So I paid four quid for these, for that and that four quid. Um, and I found these. Um, they're not got the games in. If I did, this would have been a great pickup. But for fifty p, I got. 
two cases. I've got to stop looking around. I keep looking around, but there's no one even here. Um, got two cases. Uh, wondering why I've got these, but these are actually quite high end uh, 360 games. And if I find the games loose, I can whack them in. So empty, as you can see. But the, the, this one is about about 50, 40 quid in CEX. They sell it for, which is mad. Um, so yeah, that's that's good. Um, what else did I get? Memory card as well. Nice uh, PS2 one. Um, and I also got a bag of random bits as well. This guy was selling this, this stuff in here. I didn't really didn't really need, but it was all this in here. All this in here was a pound. Um, you're probably thinking, why the hell you brought all that stuff? But a pound for a bag of goodies. He was just clearing out his stuff. Um, I've got some random stuff. I don't ever want to, like, I don't want to be interested in thinking, why the hell you bought all this shit? I'm <laughs> just like, why not? I can just take it back to a car boot and set it, I got, set it on again. But it was all a pound. So I've got some random DVDs. Some DVDs that I like, some DVDs I haven't seen. So I've got, um, good old Tarzan, which I love this. I remember seeing it at the cinema back in the day. It was, it was brilliant. Um, SpongeBob, the movie. I never seen it actually before, so yeah. Random snowboarding thing. That it's called snowboarding DVD. Face off. I've not seen that in ages, so I thought I'd grab that and give it a watch. Uh, Dr. Dre uh, album. This was all a quid, mind you. All a quid. Everything. <laughs> Whitney. Um, what is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Whitney Houston? Is it Whitney Houston? This? Yeah, Whitney Houston's uh, album. <laughs> I thought, why the hell not? You know, it's just in a box. It was cheap. Um, Tangled, brand new sealed. Um, DVD of Ted and Ted 2, or Blu ray actually. Combat, um, combined. Never seen this before. I just like like the case. Um, so that got that. Little vampire. Not seen that in years. Um, oh, this is a classic. You don't want to see this. Vampire. Um, was it lesbian vampire slayers? Have you ever seen that? It's it's great. It's got a James. Gore, is it James Gore, Gordon? Is it? What his name is? What's his name? It's got, uh, got James, yeah. Not James, it's James thing. I've got to say his name now wrong, but. Um, James Cord Corden. Yeah, that's the one. Um, yeah, it's really good. Everyone's seen it. It's, it's pretty funny. Shallow How, not seen that in years. Good film with Jack Black in it. Um, also got um, Beethoven, <laughs> like a box set. Um, stack of cups. I've heard that these could be quite expensive. I don't know. I don't know. Probably not. But it was all a quid. And a laser, one of them laser pen things. I've never had one of these. I like one of them. I think it's one of them green lasers. You'll be very careful. Don't blind someone with this. But this was in there as well. So I got all that for a quid. Like all that for a quid. I think that's pretty sick. You're probably thinking, why the hell are you... Some of you are probably thinking that. I can't keep saying that. You're probably thinking, some of you are thinking, why are you picking all that rubbish up? But A couple of DVDs to watch. And a couple of bits to maybe get rid of. I don't know. But that's it. That's my uh, my haul. That's my random bits. I hope you guys have liked it. Um, so yeah, massive thanks to everyone who's watched my recent videos. I hope you guys have enjoyed that uh, nice um, a nice Game Boy find. That was really fun getting that. Um really really happy of having that and uh, adding an upgrade to my collection um but yeah that's my hunt that's my hunt hopefully this saturday will be uh, be good to go when the weather's good hopefully um so i'm gonna hit up a saturday car boot hopefully um and there we go so basically thanks to everyone thanks so much for supporting the channel thanks so much for subscribing thanks so much for everything all support and uh, we'll see you all next one stay awesome and I'll see you at the next in the next video. Bye.